What's up dudes, my name is Nick, welcome back for another music video reaction. In this one we're taking a little bit later than I wanted to do this video uh, look at the song Keeper by The Boys. Now, I've been trying to like record this video while the roofers that are next door are not working, but the last two days they haven't been done working on you know putting the roof up on the on the neighbor's house until like 9 p.m. and because the sun's still up at 9 p.m. where I live, and so that's too late. Uh, it, the air compressors for the nail guns are going. You got the nail guns nailing stuff into the roof, and it's kind of annoying and distracting. And I was wanting the sounds that distraction to be absent from myself personally hearing it and potentially from you hearing it in the videos, but. I can't do that apparently, so I'm just gonna suck it up and record this video and you know just do what we do. So that's gonna be really it for as far as intro wise. Sorry that it's not anything relevant to the group. So we're gonna do what we do. I'm gonna listen to the song so I can give you guys my honest thoughts on it. Uh, if you're interested in more stuff like that, then subscribe to the channel because there's plenty more where this video came from. So with all that being said, let's uh, let's get it started. And uh, the first frame of this video looks rather interesting. So let's uh. I'm definitely interested to see what's up, so let's do it. For some reason, the melody of the vocals here kind of remind me of another song. I don't know what it is, but... Ah, I like, okay, I like this a little bit. Especially considering the, you know, the driving beat and all that stuff of the, of the little intro portion. Okay, I like that, I like that little pre-chorus. You know, that was good. I like I like this. This is, this is an interesting little flow right there for the the vocals of the of that verse, the rap verse, I guess is what it was. I dig it. Hmm. I, I do have to say too. I, do, I really do enjoy the the flow of the uh, of the chorus to it. I really like. I actually surprisingly like. Really, really like this song. I really, really like it. There are some really, really good things about this song that I like. I like how they just made an airplane too, that's kind of cute. Um, yeah, so... 
So far this week, we listened to a lot of songs that are from from girl groups that I would kind of consider to be sort of like the typical sort of summer so- song with, you know, with the audio and the visual aspect um, for, you know, girl groups. Like when a girl group releases a, uh, a summer song, then this is what you get. You know, then you, you already have a pretty decent idea of what it's going to sound like, what it's probably going to look like, and, you know, a lot of groups, you know, this week, in the last seven days, five days, have, you know, delivered just that that sort of basic, successful, good formula. And I think that, that this song from The Boys um, also kind of does the same, but of course with the boy group aspect of it. Now, to say that it is just like, you know, your average summer song, like, I don't necessarily think that is true either because there are actually, like, points in this song that I think stand out and are definitely, you know, more worth talking about than another group that's going to go, than another boy group that's going to release a song, you know, a boy group summer song, which is going to be, you know, again, you know, brightly colored and all that stuff like this one has, and it's going to be more cute than anything else, and it's, it's definitely, you know, a... Uh, you know, the summer songs in K-pop, you know, they have a specific vibe and a certain sound to them, and they don't deviate too much. But this one has some interesting things in it, and the, the, the main thing, of course, which is the most important part of it, is the chorus, right? Because the chorus is the thing that gets your attention, sells a song, sells the album, just causes you to check out the group and potentially spend some money on them. And I think that the chorus is a real... I, I love it. I just really, really love it. You know... The, the the music like I, like I said during the, the the video or during my reaction portion of the song like the the flow of the chorus and with it not being something that is just like you just get right through the chorus it's it's a little bit more what's the word it's broken up and all that stuff so it's syncopated that's the word that I'm kind of thinking of it it, it fe- it's not like a consistent you know flow on on like the beat of course it is because it's music and it has to be but the way that the you know, essentially, like, when you the, when you hit notes on the beat, you know, it feels a little bit different. So it's not consistent, but it's every, you know, sometimes you skip notes and you skip beats and all that kind of stuff. Basic just description of that, not necessarily, you know, what they actually did. But just the flow of it is not quite the smoothest and, you know, it, it just it just goes. It's, it's sort of broken up. And you can definitely see that because, again, what they or what they've done really well is um, associated that audio aspect of it with a super super strong visual which is of course the choreography and if you don't really understand what i'm talking about as far as how the 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 flow or the nature of how the chorus flows the the vocals and the chorus flow then just watch the watch the watch the choreography because that is a perfect visual illustration of how it flows because they are moving their their hands and their body and all that stuff you know the choreography is moving whenever they're actually saying words and then they kind of stop and change directions and do that stuff whenever they're not saying anything so at every single you know break point in the in the vocals then they have a sort of a break point so to speak in the in the choreography and that kind of creates a really really strong you know visual association with some audio and is something that is going to cement that moment in the song in people's brains much more than if you know you just had some you know catchy audio that wasn't really strongly backed up with some visuals so they did a really good job with that um i'm also really enjoying too like the, the verses honestly are pretty good you know that first verse kind of sets up the the tone and the feel with intro portion of the verse of the first verse sets up the tone and the feel for the rest of the song and then they kind of deliver a little twist on it for the final half of that the second verse is a is a, is a rap verse that doesn't exactly you know fit so to speak but it, it does it's kind of related but tangentially more of a hip-hop r&b kind of influence compared to the intro portion of the first verse and you know they just kind of take the intro portion of the first verse and then they you know kind of move it into different genres of music and everything is still related in sound and style but instead of just being a you know like an electronic song or something like that then it definitely you know swings into a little bit of hip-hop a little bit of r&b other stuff like that as the song progresses which i think is actually again something cool it, it takes what very well could be a super basic sound and style for a song it makes it something that is a little bit more interesting and adds a little bit of spice to the to this song which you know isn't bland but 
you know, in comparison to to other groups, like the the basis that this song is built off of, isn't really anything that is gonna make me, you know, perk up and pay attention to the song. But what has made me pay attention to it, of course, like I said, is the the chorus and the little twists and turns, the little kind of things that they've infused into the rest of this song to give it a little bit more, you know, spice and variety. So. That's what I think about it. I really, really like it. It's definitely, you know, th to this song, I think there's definitely more than meets the eye. So, you know, definitely, you know, check it out, listen to it a couple more times. If you've already listened to it and you didn't really like it or something like that, maybe you'll find something you enjoyed. Maybe, you know, with me talking about some stuff that maybe it'll help you, you know, realize some things that you didn't hear. Maybe you'll appreciate it a little bit more or you won't, you know, because of course it is, music is all up to, you know, your own personal taste, and so you're perfect, it's perfectly fine if you don't like the song either. So I want to know what you guys think about it. Let me know in the comments below whether you like the song or not. It doesn't really matter because I want to hear what you guys have got to say. We're trying to build a community here that is all about sharing our thoughts no matter what they are. So if you want to join that community, click the subscribe button down below. Click on that bell icon down there too if you want to turn on notifications because you're a madman and you want to be notified whenever I upload a video. So that's going to be it for now for this one, guys. As always, I want to thank you for watching and we'll see you all next time.